Hi guys, Nexi here, back with another video and today we're gonna check out this new filament oven from Sunly. Stay tuned! Welcome back guys and thanks for tuning in. This is the new version of the filament oven called Fila Dryer S2 from the company named Sunly and it's a very interesting product for 3D printer owners. Every maker knows that 3D printer filaments tends to absorb moisture from the air, especially the nylon filament, which can be a nightmare to print if the filament are not dry completely. And not only the nylon filament, even the spool of PTG and the PLA filament that stays a long time on open air can also absorb moisture from the air, which will affect the filament properties and the print quality. Some more and some less. Now for the filament drying options, some people use kitchen oven for example, but that's not really the most convenient, cheapest or the most effective way to do this job. And that's where this filament oven comes in. This filament oven uses less than 50 watt of electricity and it have a heaters all around the filament spool which heats up the filament nice and even from all sides. The touch LCD screen on the front are nice and big and it's a very easy to read information from it, even from a distance. These filament oven are nicely designed, it comes with a black bottom and a dark transparent top cover. To use this oven, simply open the top cover, place your spool of filament, close it, set your desired profile and you're ready to go. On the upper side we have the filament hole and inside of the oven there are two rollers who lets you to dry your filament and print with it in the same time, which is very useful. On the large LCD screen there is a simple menu layout with the following info. We have the current reading of the temperature inside of oven and the next one is your desired temperature where you can set the temperature in a range from 35 up to 70 degrees Celsius. On the right corner there is a humidity level which will let you to monitor the air moisture inside of the oven in real time. Next we have the drying time which can be set from 1 hour all up to 99 hours. Then we have the preset drying profiles that you can customize for a different types of filament like PLA, PTG, TPU, ABS, PA and the PC or the polycarbonate. The last is the LED light option around the screen which you can set on on, off or run. If you set it to on, the LED light will glow in a constant circle when the oven has reached the setup temperature. And when it's heating up, the light will fill up the circle like this. Double tap on the right bottom icon will turn on or off the filament oven. Overall, it's a very easy to use. When it comes to unboxing, this is not the final retail version of the product. Or the retail package. But anyway, in this bag, there was the oven and the power adapter. The oven works on 24 volt, and it never uses more than 48 watt at maximum, which is very cheap to run. Now when it comes to drying performance, I could only do a briefly test, as this is not a retail unit and it has no air vents for the moisture to escape. I was told by a Sunly contact person, which sent me this unit to test out, that on the final version there will be added the air holes on the upper side of the oven, which will greatly improve the drying performance. My guess, that's probably on these places here on the top. But anyway, According to my testing, this prototype unit reaches 50 degrees in around 10 minutes, 60 degrees in 30 minutes and the 70 degrees Celsius in around 50 minutes. The heating up results on a final retail version might vary and you can leave your results in the comments below as a comparison. Overall, I think this is a very useful product for 3D printer users, especially if you live in a high humidity area and if we take into account the current price for electricity in Europe, the filler dryer S2 will for sure get the job done, in the most easiest and the cheapest way. The retail price for this product should be around 80 US dollars, which in my opinion is a decent price tag. Alright guys, that was my quick review of the Sunly filler dryer S2. I hope that you liked this video and found it useful. The links for this filament oven you can find in the video description. Let me know in the comments how you stored your filament and how you dry it when needed. I would like to hear your opinion. I want to thank you for watching, happy new year to all and I see you next time. Bye bye.